What's up, guys? This is Drew from Mute Longboards, bring you another review, but for the Landyot Switchblade. Um, I got this board through Silverfish Longboarding by trading it with somebody for my Apex 37, which I, I didn't like. So this board is 40.5 inches long, I think. Either that or 41 inches long, and is 10 inches wide. It has, I have it double dropped, which is where the trucks are mounted drop through, and then you have these pockets right here that get you lower to the ground, and it drops the board lower. Um, I have it set up with Barry 852's uh, perfect board, perfect trucks for this board. Um, I love them. They are amazing. I have Landyot's Zombie Hogs on here. They are the 82A. They slide like butter and are perfect for just doing whatever you want, holding slides, breaking into slides, sliding. They're amazing. Um, I had Ven I had Cairo bushings in here, the 92A yellow ones, but I had to switch them back out to the bare stock pumpkin bushings because the Cairo bushings were garbage. They, If I had it tight in so it was barely touching the washer, the trucks wouldn't turn. So I had to loosen it up so that the, the hanger was just, I'd go like that, and the hanger would wobble all over the place. And I hated it, so I changed back. Um, I have Swiss bearings in here. But I use this board mainly for free riding downhill and just technical sliding. It's an amazing board for those three disciplines. It has just perfect, perfect concave for downhill and free riding. As you can see, it's got a huge concave with a W right in the middle here. This is for locking your feet in. So when you're sliding, your feet don't just fly off the board. They, they stay in there. I have never, my feet have not slipped off the board yet. I have a custom grip tape job on here which I did myself. Um, this board is perfect. It is amazing. I love it. Um, like I said, I got it through silverfishlongboarding.com and their classified section. And if you want to sell a board, buy a board, trade a board there, I, I would definitely recommend that you use that website. The uh, classifieds are they're very secure, you won't get scammed, and it's it's a good system. Um back to the board, as you can see, it's got a pretty sick graphic. I have no idea, it's like a monster eating a skull type deal right here. And it is the orange print. I know there's a a tan print, but I just like the way the orange went with the yellow wheels. Um, this is uh, a relatively new free riding and downhill board, um, so there's not many reviews on YouTube, so I thought I'd just put one out there. If you don't have this board already and you're looking for a free riding board compared to the Landy Aston 925 or uh, Rain Hellcat, I would say it's a better board. I like it. Some might disagree. The only problem is that it does not have gas pedals, but that's because you have the double drop here. But if you really wanted to, you could cut out some gas pedals right here, which I'm thinking of maybe doing. Um, so, just if you have any questions about this board, inbox me or put a comment below. Um, peace.